and they're off. Franklin Towers from the rail has speed. It's the Gray Chief Exchanger moving up in between that duo races Escondra, and Escondra is now moving to challenge the three across the course. Diamond Bachelor ducks over to the inside to race from fifth. Widest of all is Royal Ransom. Just in behind the top flight goes Modern Tail. He's situated three lengths off the lead and tugging under Hugo Sanchez. In the two path, wake me up at noon. Wide around the turn is Mission Driven while third last. Flow Motion off the speed while second last. And the trailer is Billy Big. Into the back stretch they go. Jaramillo trying to harness the speed of Franklin Towers, who leads the way three parts of a length. The Pro Chief Exchanger on the outside, second. Tucked in third is Diamond Bachelor, two lengths off the lead. Royal Ransom moves a bit closer while fourth. Up on the outside, Mission Driven is fifth. Sanchez having all kinds of trouble with Modern Tail. Just slammed on the brakes again. He's fought him every jump. Up on the outside and Billy Big and Flow Motion's last. 47 seconds for the opening half mile as they round the far turn. Chief Exchanger takes his shot at the leader, Franklin Towers. These two quicken up, work four ahead of a third running. Diamond Bachelor on his outside and Royal Ransom. Escondra tries to come up the inside lane. Wake Me Up at Noon is next and Mission Driven's been wide the whole way and they're at the top of the stretch. Less than a quarter of a mile to go. It's the nine-year-old Chief Exchanger set down for the drive on Edgar Zayas to challenge Franklin Towers for the lead. These two kick on well clear of the others. Chief Exchanger on the outside. Franklin Towers back for more inside. It's Franklin Towers. It's Chief Exchanger. Who will it be? Chief Exchanger. Chief Exchanger, the nine year old pro, got up to win it. Franklin Towers second in 127 and four. Way ticket to Overlay City in the Stronic Five. Just around the corner, Stronic Five begins with Laurel.